knights. Protect the people. Oh, I'm like about to say. Yes, what the hell came in town? But this is what Arthur's this fighting. Is a tale of Baby girl in her outfits. My God. What am I doing here? Yo. And out of all times, now she starts having weird dreams. That's right. I'm looking for Sir uh -huh. Meliodas. <laughs> Is that really him? Is that you? Look, is he all big and tall? Wait! Wait! On, what if Meliodas is an imposter? Whoa! Are you okay? Makes me want to hate him even more. You've been lying to people. Got it? Oh my God! Look at her doing the side stuff! Oh my God! Yo, baby girl! What was that? Yo, I'm sorry, by the way. I My camera used to be up above, but now it's below. So I'm sorry if I, I'm not used to paying attention where I need to look. But you get it. Don't tell me he's, he's about to control the golems. Gunther, what are you doing? Yo, Shuriken! Yo, am I even gonna edit this video? You get what? Yo! I think damage the town! It was just getting fixed! <laughs> wait! 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 <laughs> Is it over already? Whoa, it, that's it? Dude, I don't even understand what just happened. Did, um... To like freaking Diet like punish him? Got punched in the face and he's like, I don't wanna fight anymore. What is this? The bottom line is I don't understand. Indeed, I must oh, it's the baddies. A castle. But how did it get into such a wretched uh, what are you talking about? It seems to have had an explosion of magical power radiating huh? from its center. Thirty thousand feet. What hole is this? Meliodas. Meliodas? Damn him. What could he have possibly been doing huh? out here? Brother? Brother? What? Oh, yeah, give her damn memories. Yo, Gilia, put a restraining order. Get this guy out of here. Yo, yeah, yeah, get the fuck out of here. I believe how awful I was to you. I meant you no harm. No, he did not. I apologize. You deserve that and more. No, no apologies, my dude. You, yo. They weren't all made up. You showed me. All these people are stupid. Oh my God! You can pee on these women, and they're gonna be like, yay! I want to thank you for giving those. What is wrong with these people? Where's the anger? Where's the salt? Where's the you fucking weirdo? I got dumped. So, what is with these women? About. The only orders that oh, guy I just realized. The king himself. Now I know who this guy's supposed wish, to be in the in the context of this world. Slater, what is this? Is this guy supposed to be like the man in the iron mask? Be absurd. Breaching an impenetrable barrier with such flair to rescue the king, it gave me goosebumps. Allow me to call you my big sister. You wasn't even call there. You will. Then, what is it okay. you'd like me to do, big sister? Gother, come here. <laughs> Yo, cut off his head. Absolute cancer. Uh, what? Whoa! You're shrinking him? He's back to his original form, but it's only uh? temporary. A great magician created Gother what? many years ago. He's a some voodoo doll? Slater. I'm going to need for you to look after him while we're away on a mission. Oh. Okay. Yes, of course. So that explains a lot. You should be the last one to ask <laughs> that question. It's a talking pig. <laughs> so tell me, Hawk. Are you feeling any better now? Did you know that? About Gother? Nope. I just that is today. bullshit. I, I don't believe that. Motherfucker keeps a lot of secrets. He, there again, there you are, go again. I'm looking over there thinking that's a camera. I'm sorry, it's my I I'm too used to it. It's gonna take me a while to get I'm sorry. Hey, there's nothing to worry about. He's still our friend, isn't he? And one of the seven deadly sins. Yo, is there any Do these people believe in the word of consequences? 
the damage that he just created in the kingdom, the people that he just hurt. What's wrong? My head feels sort of fuzzy. What is he doing at the end? He'd like to join up with us for a little while. And stop this! You can't replace Bond! Why are you trying to recruit someone else? His Majesty. Would it be okay if I were to come along nope. too? I told you before. The battle for Ooh, me he's like, yo, what I tell you, bitch? No reason for you to yo, yo, yo. No. I'm about to, um, like, block you on Facebook. I don't know. I got bad jokes. More to you than baggage weighing you down. Exactly. <laughs> oh gosh, she is so sensitive. Get a grip, my girl. What's making that sound? Our original plans huh? have changed. We have to go to Camelot. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I sense an abnormal. My dude needs some help. Yeah, she's What's just gonna fly. No, nah, she's gonna teleport there. Oh my god. Who's that weird Mr. Bajin Boo here? Oh, back up is here. A flying pig? I'm detecting Wait, this is part of the giant race? Yeah. Wait. Great beast Albion. Wait. That? It's a weapon that was made by the demon race during okay, the Okay, never mind. Here I thought it was just one of those golem things the that the end like would make. Like I thought it was a giant who made Thingy. It's like having this nightmare. All I haven't sensed to force this. But they're saying it's something else. Turned into that monster. Eh, look at his face. It's work. Whoa. Seems throwing Yo, down baby a girl is awesome, right man. Wow. Must protect Camelot at any cost. Yo. Whoa. Everyone. Retreat. And then you got cheap ass Billy Otis. Counter! My dude is so overpowered. How's it going, Arthur? Uh, Yo. Perfect timing is Arthur always, was Merlin. blushing. Slater, take her inside. Interesting. You Things think he might be uh out here. You know, shum 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 with me out of shum shum. Shum. Well, this turned into like Shadow of Colossus. <laughs> Oh my god. Arthur! My dude! You saved my life! Oh, uh, what the he hell? Sword. He broke his sword? Please forgive me. Fighting with Hendrickson, it was already oh, come on. Up. Can't believe you lasted this long. Yeah, it... Thank you. It didn't even last that long, my guy. So much for the importance of that sword. What am I gonna do? Putting aside whether I should return that to you, let me give you this one for now. Return what? I mean, now she's being sacred treasure. A little Lost subtle. Me. You sold it to a pawnbroker, but I bought it back. Wait. And I'm charging interest. You mean you had the captain's sacred treasure? So she all had time? his sacred sword cheap, thing. I can you. Why is that Albion acting so strange? Yeah, what the hell is making <laughs> cannons? You turned it right huh? Well, well. Shadow Cloud Jusso. What can you do this? Dude, you like blew him up. Huh, what do you know? <laughs> I get Come on, Jericho. You're not really planning to stay um, here, right? Mind your business. Alone, okay? After all, and to be honest, I've had just about enough of living with my older brother. <laughs> you mean go home now. What? Oh, she's a uh, so cute. Can't be. What the hell's going on now? <laughs> Forest is growing somehow. Huh? How can it start sprouting up at this speed? Seriously, the fan the service. My guy. Actually, it does. And a once every few years, a man comes and replenishes all life in the forest. Oh. As soon as I'm done here, I'm leaving this forest. No way. Yeah, he is the fun of youth. That's just wicked that he can just bleed anywhere and he just heals the forest. That's interesting. Weird. Oh, come on. God, the more you, we see her, the more she looks younger. Sir Bon? If you were to be the ruler of this place, wouldn't that make the other fairies happy? 
It's much different than being a human king. The fairy king isn't picked by those who live oh. here, nor is he able to name himself. Instead, he is chosen by the sacred uh, tree. I guess I'm not qualified for it either. After all, you're nothing more than the nutrients for this forest. What? Yo, you talking a lot of shit. You don't even have to do any of what he's doing. What's going on? We're ungrateful. Something isn't right here. You know what I'm saying? What? Well, they're getting attacked? Wait, is that another golem thing? Like, the one that they were fighting? Okay, what the shit? Man, how dare they? There was no after credits. Jesus, this is gonna take me a while. I keep looking up there and, and thinking, oh look, the camera's over there. I, I think I said it too many times in today's video. Alright, you get it. I get it. I know. I changed my camera. It sucks. Anyway, cool episode. Really loved it. Um, cool thing about Seven Deadly Sins that I really enjoy a lot is how beautiful it looks, man. The animation, the way it pops, the colors, the high deafness of it all. It's just, my God, this show is tremendous when it comes to, I guess, its budget. Even another thing that's extremely impressive with this show is that they don't let up, man. They usually end an episode with a cool cliffhanger, and as soon as the next one starts... They finished that story arc thing situation in like a minute. Here I thought we were going to be distracted with a Gaunther situation that could probably last an episode. They got done with in like less than a minute. We found out that Gaunther was made by some strong wizard a very long time ago. It doesn't really matter how long. But what does matter is that he is a puppet. He's, he's, he's a bundle of voodoo magic, I guess, that he himself doesn't know how to use or comprehend. Let alone, he is this bundle of magic, yet is seeking an identity that he himself can't comprehend. Uh, I think it's pretty poetic, it's pretty smart, it's pretty tragic, I guess. All the freaking Sin members all have tragedies, at least so far, in a way. I can relate with Gaunther and Bond's tragedies. I understand Kings, but it's man eh, to me and... I don't even really know what Meliodas situation is. The end is just abandonment issues, I guess. Why was she she's an orphan giant? Where the hell's her family? I don't know. Why is she lost? And then as far as Merlin, what kind of tragedy could she have? I mean, baby girl got her shit in control, man. Cause we also got to see that in today's episode. Because it looks like, uh, King Arthur was having a situation. And, you know, Merlin was like sensing that. She's like, oh, I gotta go get. We gotta go and help him, and she used her magic to, to help his kingdom. And Baby Girl is a badass. Now, there was this weird clay golem thing that was attacking, I, I would assume, was Camelot, right? Um, why was it attacking Camelot? I'm not sure if the characters uh, alluded to that. Meliodas was able to take it down by using his sacred uh, treasure, which Merlin had. It looks like Meliodas is asking Merlin to return something that she took away from him. And I fear I thought it was just his lost memories, right? Uh, but it looks like she took something else. Now, I'm going to go on a super limp here, right? And I'm going to assume that what Merlin took was the second half of his sword, right? In the beginning of the show, right, we only saw him have that little snaky thingy, uh, the sheath, the thing that Dreyfus and Hendrickson used to open the demon gate, whatever. What I have a feeling that maybe Merlin took the blade away from the handle, and that's what Meliodas wants back. So he can complete his sword, whatever. Now, what does that sword do, and how powerful it is? I'm sure it's a very powerful sword, especially Meliodas. With seeing how powerful Meliodas just is with a regular sword, imagine wielding some demon sword thing. I don't know. That's just my speculation. We also saw the baddies as well. We saw the Ten Commandments. Uh, go to some weird place. Again, it, it was a lot of uh, subtlety there. Uh, they accuse they accuse Meliodas of causing something to that place, and it looks like they're plotting their next move. Now, the episode ended with uh, the forest of the fairy peoples getting attacked by yet one of those weird golems that was just attacking King Arthur's kingdom. But yeah, overall, it was a really good episode. I'm digging the direction where the show's going. I'm digging the intensity, the action, and the drama, man. I love drama. So, yeah. <laughs> so, all right, that about wraps up uh, today's episode. What are your thoughts? 
Did you like it? Did you hate it? Discuss with me and others by leaving me any positive or negative feedback down in that comment section. Feel free to like this video or subscribe to my channel if you haven't before. And as always, God bless you. Thanks so much for watching and farewell for now. Bye-bye.